well, this is Reynolds, so of course everyone wants to work here. That allows you to do something. I've been at other jobs before, and they didn't have the labs, they didn't have the equipment that you can either get your hands on or look at the documentation. I feel like we have a well-rounded way of learning new things, looking at what we have and learning what we already have, and looking to the future for newer things that we've never even done yet. I feel challenged by the broad scope of everything I get to test. I get to try anything from new server infrastructure to new desktop PCs, and the wide range of it makes me feel really well-rounded. Reynolds being an industry leader is something that's always excited me. I'm really into the networking aspect of my job, so we get to work with new routers, new switches, and ways to deploy our technology. We have a great data center here. We have thousands of pieces of equipment to monitor, to learn, and it's very leading edge. Not many people have data centers in their own building. So I started as an intern, uh, showed that I had some of the qualities they're looking for in engineering, research, troubleshooting, and after a few months I was offered full-time. Reynolds has their own line of training courses based off of stuff like Linux certifications, uh, Microsoft server certifications. We've got a couple different trainings for networking, stuff like that, and you go through those at your own pace. People who are interested in technical positions in Reynolds and Reynolds are going to be blown away by the ability to go and lab up new ideas, test them out, make sure they work, and then help get them to the user community, to the people that need them. It's a very rewarding experience because you get to start from the beginning and work all the way to the end. Someone looking to get into tech here at Reynolds would need to be someone that's willing to learn, somebody that's got a you know inquisitive mindset, and somebody that's really willing to try and solve problems.